was thinking about that. I love St. Patrick's Day. That's a good time. You know, everyone goes out, they have fun. They say everybody wants to be Irish or whatever it is. Or, you know, everybody's like happy on St. Patrick's Day. And it's fun. You know, you listen to Irish music, you, you eat Irish food, you drink, you know, traditional Irish alcohol. You watch The Quiet Man, <laughs> which I love. It's a great movie. I start thinking, like, why the fuck isn't there, like, what would be the St. Patrick's Day equivalent to, like, Italian? Where's the, like, St. Tony's Day? You know what I mean? <laughs> like, where, where is, like, I, I feel like there's a lot of potential there that we haven't tapped in yet. Instead of watching The Quiet Man, you're watching The Godfather, right? Instead of eating corned beef and cabbage, you're eating lasagna, pizza cannolis pasta meatballs chicken par garlic bread i think the eating healthy is getting to me but so you could have it with wine right sambuca fucking i don't know lemoncello peroni get a bunch of italian beers peroni's good i could drink peroni for a day have a good time Listen to fucking Frank Sinatra, Louis Primo, huh? It's about a I'm telling. I think it would be awesome. I think it's a great idea, obviously, and there's a lot of untapped potential there. I think with enough work and enough backing, St. Tony's Day could outshine St. Patrick's Day. No, I'm going to get a comment on that. I think an Italian equivalent to St. Patrick's Day is a must. I think we've got a band together. If you're with me, give me a like. <laughs> if not, forget about it.